Hey ladies, what's up? So I picked up this new bag from Forever 21. It was $29. I really like this bag. It's so clean cut. It's so classy. And I think it's perfect for the fall. It's really spacious. It has like three big sides. One in the middle and two on the sides. And it also has side pockets. I just really love this Carmel color bag. It's everything. I, it's just so my style. And you guys, I picked up this metallic makeup bag from Forever 21. It was like $6.90. It's so girly. It's so cute. It's like a rose gold pink color. It's super roomy. It's just, it's just so cute and noticeable. So I'm going to show you guys what I put in my makeup bag. So first we're going to start off with some hand sanitizer. I have to keep hand sanitizer on me because you guys know I have a baby. And we have to keep clean hands. Then I'm going to just add my favorite new gloss. Then I'm going to add some eye drops just in case my eyes irritate me with my lashes. Then I'm going to add my favorite Kevin Klein perfume. I always got to keep little samples of perfume in my bag. I'm going to add me a powder brush to touch up my makeup with, of course. I'm going to add my favorite setting powder, which is my MAC Studio Fix. Then I'm going to go ahead and add my favorite concealer from Maybelline. I love this concealer. It's so everyday. It's lightweight. I always keep it in my purse. I love it, love it, love it. Then I'm going to add my Ulta Full Coverage Concealer. This is one of my fullest coverage concealer. I love it when I'm trying to wake up for real. Then, of course, a beauty blender to blend in those products. I got me some edge control. Yes, girl. This is edge control. It looks like a lip gloss, but it's edge control. Just in case my edges need to be laid and slayed. <laughs> I got it. I got it. This is so cute. I got it from the hair store for about $1.99. Then I got my Sit Bird perfume, my travel perfume. This is Marc Jacob Daisy. Love that perfume. Then I got one of my favorite lipsticks from MAC, and this is just Velvet Teddy. This is like an everyday nude. I have me some mascara, because you guys know I like my bottom lashes on fleek at all times. <laughs> then I got me a pencil sharpener, just in case my lip liners get a little dull. I got me some more lip gloss, because, girl, you got to keep your lips nice and juicy and shiny. Then I got my star glue, um, just in case my eyelashes decide to pop off on the ends. I got it. Have my favorite two liners. This is the NYX Suede Liners. They are so creamy. Guys, they would definitely be in my favorite. So that's all the stuff that I have in my makeup bag. It's pretty packed out, but it's still a lot of room. I just love this makeup bag. I'm going to complete this video by showing you guys how I put it in my purse and the other little stuff that I keep in my purse. I don't like my purse to be overcrowded, but I always have a lot of stuff in my purse. So I already put my wallet in the middle part with the zipper. And I still, I put my makeup um, bag on the other side. And on the other side, the opposite side, I'm going to go ahead and add my shop key. Have my little key ring with me and Joseph and baby Joseph. Then I got my iPhone 6, of course. With my gold case. I love that case. It's so clean looking. Then I got this big huge mirror. You guys, I just do the most. I actually got that mirror from Forever 21 for about $3.90. I love that mirror. Then I got my Holly Berry Closer Body Lotion. I love that scent. It's so strong, but I do love it. So that's it. What's in my bag, y'all? And I still have so much room. I have my sunglasses. I'm just going to put that on the outside of my purse because I grab for those the most. So, oh, and I also got some blotting sheets from Forever 21 just in case I get a little oily. And I got this little burgundy fur ball because the fall is right around the corner. And this purse is just definitely a fall purse. So I'm going to just add this just to add a little character to the purse. 
And that's it, guys. This is my fallback. Have a great day. Bye.